Once upon a time, there was a miller who had three sons. When he died, he left his mill to his eldest son, his donkey to his second son, and to the youngest, he left only a cat. The youngest son was disappointed, thinking he got the worst deal. But the cat, who was clever and resourceful, said, Fear not, master. With me by your side, your fortune will change. The cat asked for a pair of boots and a sack. With these, he went into the forest and caught rabbits and birds, which he presented to the king as gifts from his master, the Marquis of Caraba, a title he gave to his poor master to make him sound important. That one day, the cat learned that the king and his daughter would be passing by. He instructed his master to bathe in the river and hide his clothes. As the king's carriage approached, the cat cried out, Help! My lord Marquis of Caraba is drowning. The king stopped and ordered his guards to rescue the Marquis. When the king saw the handsome young man dressed only in his undergarments, the cat said, Thieves have stolen my master's clothes. The king immediately ordered his servants to bring fine clothes for the Marquis and invited him into the carriage. The cat ran ahead, instructing the local peasants to tell the king that the land they were passing belonged to the Marquis of Caraba when they reached the castle belonging to an ogre who owned vast lands. The cat learned that the ogre could turn into any animal. So, he tricked the ogre into turning into a mouse, and the cat swiftly caught and devoured him. The king was impressed by the Marquis's supposed lands and riches, and he offered the princess's hand in marriage to the Marquis. Overjoyed, the youngest son agreed, and the cat, who had orchestrated everything, became a respected and cherished member of the court. And so, the youngest son, thanks to his clever cat, became a wealthy and powerful marquis, living happily ever after. <laughs>